G'day Southland Anglers, the new fishing season is here, so I thought I'd give you a few tips and pointers and maybe some ideas on what you might like to try this season. First up, we have the middle reaches of the Oriti and Aparima rivers. These areas are absolutely full of trout. Recent drift dives in the mid Aparima have shown a healthy population of brown trout. Top lure choices in these areas include small bladed spinners, rapalas and soft baits. My favourite access point on the Oriti is at the Dipton Bridge, and my favourite access point on the Aparima is at the end of McIntosh Road. The lower reaches of the Oriti and Aparima are also worth a go. These river sections are already fishing really well, and there are heaps of bait fish coming up into the rivers, and the trout are feasting on them. Swinging a soft bait across and down the current is a great option. Silver tobies and small wedges are also fishing well. And if you like fly fishing, a smelt like feathered lure is hard to beat. Next up, there is the lower Matawa River between Wyndham and Gore. In this river section alone, there are over 20 angler access points, so anglers are spoilt for choice. This section of river has some of the highest trout numbers in Southland. The black and gold toby is a great go-to lure choice for the lower Matawa River, and a top access point is at Colpit Road. A great river choice for the less experienced anglers is the Makariwa River. The Makariwa River is one of my favourite rivers because trout and perch there are really easy to catch. Top lure choices include brightly coloured toby lures of about 7 to 10 grams. And finally, for the big water enthusiasts, check out Waituna Lagoon. Spawning surveys this year have shown that there's a healthy population of trout with an average size of about 559mm, which is slightly longer than the long term average. So there you have it. A few tips for this season. Good luck out there.